Hey there YouTube, Joe's Guides one here with another episode of the Zombie Weapons Guide. Today's episode we'll be reviewing the Cinder Block, which is not a great weapon. Probably a really bad one. Um, the reason why is because Cinder Blocks are really heavy. Um, like 20 or 30 pounds, I don't know, I don't, I don't really care. That's probably That probably makes me sound like a huge pussy, but whatever. Um, they're really heavy, which means that it's going to be harder to, you know use it more, and plus they break apart really easy too, which is another bad thing, um, you know, like I said, they're heavy, so you can't really use it that much, and, um, <laughs> pardon me, and, um, I mean, I can't really think of any situations when you would want to use it, because it's such a small weapon, and it breaks so easy, and, like, you know, in the test, the only thing I could think of is if, like, you got some zombie on the ground and you smashed its head in with the cinder block. That's all I can think of. Um, I guess you could throw it at him. That's a good thing. You could throw it, and you could build a fort, fortress out of it. So maybe if your barricade starts coming down, you can just pick one up um, as a last resort. You know, that's a good thing. Um, but aside from that, I can't really think of any uses. So, uh, anyway, let's get to some tests. So, the difficult thing about using a cinder block is that it's heavy as shit, and the only reason in which you would ever actually have to use one is if... Fuck you, Eric. Alright, here we go. Never mind. No, but anyway, the only reason you would ever actually have to use one is if you're, like, standing over somebody that you just knocked down. That's the only time I can really see using one of these. But, um, anyway, here we go. Hope you can see this. brains didn't work. My blood and brains didn't work, so... Want some? Anyways. Until next time, this is Joe Scuds1 saying don't fear the apocalypse. Welcome.